Hey there, field agronomist Joe Iles coming to you from Western Wisconsin and in this video we are going to talk about horsetail control using the Enlist herbicide management system. Okay, so a little bit about this weed right here. This is a perennial weed, not to be confused with mare's tail. This bugger comes from prehistoric ages. It was around at the time of the dinosaurs. There's a reason why it's a nasty weed because it's found ways to really survive a long time using various mechanisms to avoid things like our standard herbicides such as glyphosate. So interestingly, this weed reproduces by something called rhizomes. Rhizomes are roots that grow underground and then produce new shoots that come right back up. Sometimes these things can go down six feet in the ground, which makes it really hard for tillage as well as herbicides to get there. Additionally, this has a waxy cuticle on the outside of its, well, we guess we can call them leaves, but they're not really leaves. That waxy cuticle doesn't allow water-based herbicides in, and therefore it's very difficult for herbicides like glyphosate to get inside the plant and actually kill it. So managing this weed is awfully tough based on the tools that we've historically had. Now the good news is, is that this weed is in fact on the label of the Enlist herbicide. And as a result of that, for those of you who have Enlist soybeans planted this year, as you're coming around for your second pass, uh, you will have a much greater chance of controlling this weed using the Enlist herbicide in managing horsetail. So, from Western Wisconsin, field agronomist Joe Wilds, there's your information on management of horsetail in soybeans. That concludes this Pioneer Agronomy video podcast. Visit our page on pioneer.com and follow us on Twitter and Facebook for more agronomy insights.